So the first thing that we do is we check the chain stretch. Anything around 75% means the chain needs replacing. Anything over that means that we need some attention to the cassette and chain rings in case they're worn out. Next, we check the hub bearings in the wheels. So we spin the axles and we actually remove the wheel first. So we give them a bit of a spin. If they're really rough, it means that the bearings are worn out. So one of the most important things to look for now is any impacts to the frame where there might be cracks or failures. Secondary to that, looking for any stress fractures around your bottom bracket or pivot points is essential. Some mountain bike specific things to look for include looking at the dust wipers of the suspension, doing a quick pivot test and checking the trueness of the wheels. So for road bikes specifically, we look for any cracks in the fork steerer and the seat post from any over tightening or any extra force being put through it and any stress fractures in the bottom bracket. 